Hi everyone, happy Thursday. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com here. We did it. We knocked out the Jaspies 9 box TV12 football mixer with four Brady rookies being given away. You can see them in the photo right over here. Pretty nice stuff. Pretty solid break too. 32 spot break, no uh, no vet common ship, lots of 2020 in this mixer. We're chasing Herbert, Burrow, etc., etc. And here's the mixer right here. We're going to close with that box of hit parade. That should be pretty fun. Big thanks to this group for getting into the action. Thanks to the people who bought their spots straight up. And congrats again to the people uh, who won spots in those two fillers. I think we had originally planned for like four fillers. But people bought were buying full spots so quickly, we were able to kill some fillers. We only had to do two. So thank you very much, everybody. I appreciate that. Um, all teams are in. Let's do it. Let's roll it. Randomize names and teams. Four and a two, six times. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. We got Nick down to Matt. Four and a two, six times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. We got my Raiders up top and the Washington Commanders down at the 32 spot. All right, Nick, you got my Raiders. Dean with the Dallas Cowboys. Chris with the Chargers. Nice. Fred with the Vikings. Bennett with the Bears. Thomas with the Rams. Simon with the Texans. Joel with the Packers. Mac with the Titans. Chad uh, with the Bengals. Chris with the Broncos. Jared with the Jaguars. Jonah with the Jets. Dun, 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 dun. Thomas with the Falcons. Dean with the Eagles. Sean with the Buccaneers. Adam with the Giants. Aaron with the Dolphins. Anthony with the Niners. Alex with the Chiefs. Matt. With the Cardinals, Michael. With the Seahawks, Gale. With the Panthers, Stephen. With the Patriots, Nicholas. With the Lions, Stephen. With the Browns, Dusty. With the Bills, Jesse. With the Colts, Kennard. With the Steelers, Michael. With the Ravens, Jared. With the Saints, and Matt. With the Washington Commanders. We're going to alphabetize by team. And we're going to pause the video in just a second. Here, let me show you the boxes really quick. So a lot of good stuff here. We're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. Then we will have the break. Stick around. BRB. All right. Trade window closed. Welcome back, everybody. A little bit of trade chatter, but in the end, no deals were done. In Jaspie's 9-box TV12 football mixer. At the end of the break, along with any other randomizers uh, that we may or may not have to do, We'll give away these Brady's. So if you have what you think is a bad team in this break, or if you're not having a good break, your teams aren't hitting, don't worry, you can still cross your fingers for those Brady's. Top four out of the 32. All right, let's start with the uh, Chronicles first, 2020 Chronicles. Look, everybody, you've seen a lot of these packs in various fillers in the past. Remember, uh, Vet Commons do not ship in this break. everybody. We 
We've got some rookie QBs here. That's what we're hunting for. Jalen Hurts, Philadelphia doubling down on Jalen Hurts being their guy. I think I think give him with a little seasoning, he could be pretty good. Nice, oh, sorry, C.D. Lamb. There's a nice uh, Justin Herbert here for the Chargers. Chris Hansen with the Bolts. Mac, who, who am I thinking for March Madness? UCLA, all the way. I actually have not done any research at all. I only become a, uh, <laughs> I only become an expert when um, there's a nice Joe Burrow here after the brackets are set. Then all of a sudden. I become an expert. Nice Joe Burrow for Cincinnati. That goes to Chad Tucker. Got another Chronicles Joe Burrow for Cincinnati, Chad Tucker. This is 2020. I was like, that's not Zach Wilson. That's James Morgan. And a quarter all pass and autograph. Nice. 157 at 299 for Bennett and the Bears. Autograph not too common in these Chronicles retail packs. Wait, hold on. We, we got to wait until we're closer to, to uh, bracket time before you start talking about that, Oliver. My brain's not going to remember all of that. Uh, but all we're saying, USF, San Francisco, Sweet 16, book it, Joe. I like that. Mac likes it, too. I think these prisms are also pretty short printed out here. There's Jordan Love for the Packers. That'll be for Joel. And we've got another Tua, Copper Parallel for the Miami Dolphins, Aaron Billingsley. Mac thinks Auburn is going to win it all. Yeah, it's almost that time of year, isn't it? Another Justin Herbert rookie card for for Chris and the Chargers. And some Tua's as well for Miami, Aaron Billingsley. Michael L. thinks Purdue is going to win it all. Too much balance on that team. US, U, USF is uh, Oliver's 11 seed pick. Also where you went to school. Mate. The first time since 1998 since they got into the tournament. Mac thinks most of the Big Ten will be out by the Sweet 16. Why? I'm not too too up on college basketball. These Omega parallels are exclusive to this set. Joe Burrow, Chad Tucker, Cincinnati. Another Joe Burrow here. Remember when they said Joe Burrow's hands were too small? Who's that, who's that one quarterback kid who's making headlines because his hands are apparently too small? Nice acetate, Justin Herbert. 
Chris Hansen with the uh, with the Chargers. Gotcha. So Oliver's tip is got to watch a lot of college basketball this week because that's going to tell me a lot about who to pick. They said this guy's hands were too small too. I think Joe Burrow tweeted that out. He said Alex Smith's hands were too small too. He, he carved out a nice career. Justin Herbert right here too. All right, that was your Chronicles. All right, uh, let's see. I guess we'll get this Rookies and Stars out of the way. This is what Rookies and Stars looked like back in the day, back in 2015. It's a giant box. Tell why they changed the configuration on this after some time. So, Pickett's hands are the smallest by far? Like, how. I mean, how small are is his hands? Oliver thinks that he's going to fall and Malik Willis moves up to a number 11 to the Commanders. There's Antonio Gibson die cut to 49. And Dante Fowler Jr. is your autograph. Rookies and Stars auto, 10 out of 25 for the Jags. That's going to go to Jared in the Jaguars. There's Amari Cooper, rookie die cut. And we got a Todd Gurley, rookies and stars. Rookie relic, dressed for success. Man, I thought this guy was going to be... I mean, he had a couple of really great seasons, but it's just sort of injuries betrayed him. Kind of declined pretty quickly. Mike Davis, Keenan Allen to two ninety nine. Kevin Johnson to fifty, and we got a Bryce Petty piece of his jersey. Pickett had twenty two fumbles. Last season? Oh, yeah, that's not good. Out of 99, Chris Conley. Can you dig it? Stephon Diggs, rookie relic for the Vikings. Fred for the Vikings. There's Des Bryant, 299. And they call on Kaepernick, Mike Davis, rookie the stars. They're sharing that relic right there. Niners, that'll be for Anthony. Tyler Lockett, jersey and auto, rookie jersey and auto, nice. That'll be for the Hawks of the Sea, Michael.
All right, onwards. Next box. Loaders here. All right, twenty twenty one elite football. There's the season for the Los Angeles Lakers. It was a nice run, I guess. by Frank Vogel. It might not be entirely his fault, but I mean, good coaches just kind of figure it out, right? There's Darius Leonard to 9.99. Terrace Marshall Jr., turn of the century gold speckle to 25. Nice. Yeah, by Anthony Davis, by Rob Palinka. I don't know if they're gonna move. I mean, can you move Anthony Davis? Joseph Osai to nine ninety nine. Julio Jones to three ninety nine. Falcons. Yeah, Lakers are a bunch of individuals, not a team. I mean, they, they took a big, big, big swing and a miss. You know, on uh, there's a Craftsman Relic, A.J. Brown, Titans, Mac. They took a big swing and a miss with Russell Westbrook and uh, choosing to make that big trade and let Caruso walk and all that. Um... Ooh, nice Mac Jones. I don't know what this parallel is, but it's out of 25. Fireworks? Looks like fireworks. We'll call it that. To 25. That's for the Patriots, Stephen Flat. And a rookie elitist, Trevor Lawrence, for the Jaguars. That'll be for Jared. Yeah, I mean, who? but who's going to trade for... Who's going to trade for Anthony Davis, Oliver? Guy that's never on the court. And I think he, Buddy Heald may not have been a sexy name, but have, would have been a better, would have been a better uh, fit for this team, I think. It was Justin Fields at three ninety nine. And I think they still would have had some some. I mean, Buddy Heald doesn't cost as much as Russell Westbrook, so there would have been some payroll flexibility there too. Possibly at the trade deadline. Ooh, nice. Purple ink autograph, Jamar Chase. Rookie pen pals autograph for Chad Tucker and the Cincinnati Bengals. What a season he had. Yeah, Brandon saying even John Wall would have been a better... Yeah, 
But then the Lakers didn't want to. I think that deal could have happened, but I think there's Mike Kosicki right here. I don't think they wanted to give up like their 2027 20, first round pick or something like that. They're already don't have first round picks, so. But like, why wouldn't you though? There's Miko Hardman to 25. I don't think Chad Tucker was trying to trade the Bengals, Mac. I think the offers for the Bengals were made. I don't think Chad Tucker would have would have moved the Bengals. I don't know. I don't know if he's in the chat. So. All right. So that was elite. Nice. Uh, Jamar Chase autographs popping out of that elite. All right, what about some Optic Hybrid? Optic H2. Let's see what we got here. We got Retro Seer. Oh, these cards are all flipped around, upside down, inside out. We got Tua, Red Mojo. That's for Miami. That'll go to Aaron Billingsley. Not numbered. Taylor had a really nice season. Colts, he just kind of ran out of steam towards the end. I think the Colts too themselves, but I feel like they, like they were, they were on their way. He was on his way to a really nice season. Are are the Colts going to get a new quarterback? I feel like there's been some suggestions there. Right, agreed, Brandon. You don't, yeah, you don't need first round picks if you're winning, but if you aren't, they hurt. <laughs> but I mean, Lakers have found like been able to find diamonds in the rough. Like Austin Reeves is a pretty solid player, but I mean, he's definitely not enough. Just, I mean, they they, they rolled the dice with with uh, they rolled the dice with Westbrook. Didn't work out. To 199, Mammoth Materials, Devin Duvernay, Ravens, that'll be for Michael. It happens, I'll just have to figure it, I gotta figure it out this, this offseason. Justin Herbert, Mammoth Materials, Rookie Relic, 10 out of 99 for the Chargers, Chris. The book, Rookie Signature, nice, Tyler Johnson. 82 out of 99. I don't have any uh, slider boxes, but I'll, I'll grab some. That'll be for the Buccaneers. That's for Sean Maddock. And for the Steelers, we've got Anthony McFarland Jr. Nice relics there. Nice autograph. 44 out of 99. 44, that's me. Woo! Get some cold cuts. That's for Kennard with the Steelers. Get some cold cuts. Gonna get me some cold cuts today. 44 ladies, that's me. All right. XR football. The Icky Woods commercial. 44, that's me. There's AJ es uh, Epinesa to 249. Cam Newton to 199. 
149, Clyde Edwards Elaire and a LaVisca Chenault Jr. jersey and autograph. It's 006 out of 149 for Jacksonville. That's going to be for Jared and the Jags. Here's Michael Pittman Jr. rookie card. We got Jake from State Farm to 249, Jalen Ragor to 99. Kirk Cousins, Justin Jefferson, dual relic, 64 out of 99. Does Kirk Cousins stay in Minnesota? I feel like there's been talks about him being moved. I feel like quarterbacks get talked about being moved or traded all the time. Does How often does that really happen? Cole Komet for the Bears, 26 out of 49. Luminous endorsements for Bennett and the Bears. All right, 2021 Mosaic football, two autographs per box on average. Like that guy, people are thinking, is that, that guy really going to move though? I don't know. I guess that's, well, this could be the year where all of a sudden there is a lot of quarterback movement. No, that's not true, right? Yeah, hey, listen, Brandon, Kirk Cousins always puts up good numbers, but, you know, just fans just tend not to like him. I guess the, those numbers aren't coming at the right time, I guess. But what I think about the Commanders, as did, what's the story behind that, Rebel? That's, that can't be true. Pat Fryermuth is your first autograph. Rookie auto for the Steelers. I feel like he had a solid season. That goes to Kennard Bolt in Pittsburgh. They got to find a new quarterback. Pittsburgh. <laughs> Mac Jones rookie card. Eight out of ten, Amonra St. Brown, rookie gold. Detroit Lions, Nicholas. Oh, you think it was a joke that so they may be looking for a QB article? I write something about Mahomes or Shell. Yeah. That'd be that that'd be funny if that was true though. That'd be how 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 like how ballsy would that be? A lot of guts there, if Ron Rivera calls up or whoever the GM is for the Commanders call up. Yeah, what would an offer even look like? I mean, there'd have to be a combination of players and nice rookie red Zach Wilson players and like multiple first round picks, right? Nice. I think I'm pretty sure the red parallels. They're not numbered, but they're they're shorter printed. Jonah for the Jets. Dun, 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 dun.
all the picks for the next 10 years and a lot of players. I mean, realistically, it probably wouldn't be that. You know, there's probably a formula, a number out there. You know, I would say it would be like three or four first round picks. You know, whatever quarterbacks they have on the roster, you know, Chase Young and like Terry McLaurin or something like that. Maybe three first, Chase Young and Terry McLaurin. There's Jamie Newman. Maybe four firsts. And then maybe you'd still have to, I think the commanders would still have to take, who are some like bad contracts on your, on your team, on the Chiefs? They'd have to eat those contracts too. You know, so it would be like, It'd be like a, like a kind of a salary dump, clear the cap, get a bunch of assets back, kind of thing. And, and it's still, but you would still, it would, it would, it may, like numbers wise, it may make sense, but I'll, you could never sell that to the fans though, ever. It would be a PR disaster. Because you can make the argument of, oh, you know, pass rushers, they last like 15 years and the value you get for the money, your bank for your buck for the money for pass rushers, look over the years, it's like the best value because they always say that, right? When you're drafting in the first round, defensive ends end up sticking around for like 10, 15 years and give you so much production, blah, blah. You couldn't, you couldn't sell that to the fans though. Sixteen out of ninety-nine, Joe Mixon. Yeah, that guy's not getting moved. Not anytime soon. It'll be crazy. The only way that would that would happen is if I don't know. It wouldn't. I mean, the 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 Chiefs are too built too well. But I was gonna say if there were like in a complete rebuild for whatever reason. You know, like let's say they were just they just had no one else on that team. You know, and it was just Mahomes and his and a huge contract and they weren't going anywhere and you know, unless like Mahomes asked for a trade or something like that, you know, it just wouldn't happen. Trevor a couple of Trevor Lawrences for uh, Jared and the Jags. Out of 25, Drew Brees. <laughs> yeah, I guess the Herschel Walker trade did happen. That wasn't just years ago, maybe maybe decades ago, right? That's a, that's a different time in the league, though. Yeah, I feel like I feel like Mahomes has built up so much credit with the Chiefs. I just it's, just, it's gonna take. I don't know what it would take. It would it would have to take just. At least, what, three? Th How long would it take, Rebel, before Chiefs fans sour on Patrick Mahomes? You'd have to have, like, you know, multiple four-win seasons in a row and him just healthy, playing all 17 games, but just not producing at all. I mean, it would, it would just, it would be, you'd have to have three or four years of that. All right, we're almost there. This break went a little bit faster than I thought. Actually, no, this break went about, we're about 35 minute mark. I said 35, 40 minutes. Ooh, a redemption. Got a Davis Mills rookie. Tannehill. Devontae Adams to 50. Where does he end up? Steve Largent. Z jerseys, relic. 26 out of 149. But even then, I could see Mahomes going four win seasons, you know. 15, 20 interception seasons for three, even three or four years in a row. And I think Chiefs fans still be like, don't worry, he'll turn a corner. He's built that much credit. And even then, he'll probably, his that next season, he might throw for 50 touchdowns. This guy had a really nice season. Eli Mitchell. I picked him up early in my fantasy football season. It was great for me. Think about it. What if Mahomes, if the Bears drafted him and said, would Trubisky be what Mahomes is now? No. But 
I think Trubisky would have a lot of success in that system just because it was a good system. There are that. They already have, were a playoff team with like Alex Smith, right? Or close to it. All right, good luck, everybody. Rookie patch autographs, Copper. J. O. S. H. Josh. Josh Palmer. Josh Palmer Chargers? Yeah, he's a Charger. That'll go to Chris and the Bolts. All right, now a box of limited football. Limited football, limited. Hit Parade football, limited edition. What is this? This is 2021 Series 73. In case you're keeping track of the series. All right, what do we got here? Well, we have a dual autograph. Wow. One out of 10, Brett Favre, Sterling Sharp, black ink autograph from Immaculate Football. That is strong, from 2017, Immaculate Football. Packers, Joel, won that spot in a filler and gets a nice dual autograph. There you go, now let's give away some Brady's. Let me, I don't think I set up that other tab for the Brady giveaway. Let me just do that really quick. All right, so let's flip back to list here. Here's the order. We're just randomizing your names and not the, uh, not the cards. And I think these are sorted. I think Nick listed these in order of uh, value, highest to lowest. And the lowest valued one is still pretty nice. Just look, up, look it up on, on, on the bay. All right, so let's gather everybody's names. I think I have some new dice, new list. There we go. Let's gather everybody's names from tab one. From Matt down to Matt and everybody in between. New dice, new list. And remember, it's just the top four. Just the top four. We're going to win those ratings. Let's roll it. Good luck, everybody. Let's roll it. Randomize it. Three and a two, five times. Top four after five. Good luck. One, two, three, four. And fifth and final time. Fingers crossed, everybody. Good luck. The five spots the worst. Because you're very you were very close, but just not quite there. Matt, sorry. Thanks everybody who got in. Appreciate it. Thanks for trying. But congrats to the top four. You got some Brady's. Jared, a Brady. Stephen Flat, a Brady. Jared, a second Brady. And Nick, a Tom Brady. Beautiful. Nick with the Quantum Brady, Jared with the Ultra Brady, Stephen with the Paramount Brady, and Jared with the Score Brady. There's the Quantum Brady. Uh, BGS 9, centering edges uh, a 9, surface 9, 5, corners 8, 5 for a total grade of 9. Jared, Ultra Brady, PSA 9. Steven, Paramount, Brady, BGS9, centering, uh, edges and corners, all a 9-5, surface an 8. And Jared again, score, Brady. BGS9, centering is an 8-5, edges are a 9, corners and surface a 9-5. Nice. There you go, gang. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Here's a quick little recap. Thanks for watching. Thanks for joining this break. I appreciate everybody uh, grinding through all of the fillers we had to do. We had to do a, a few, right? Thanks for that. Appreciate everybody buying their spots straight up.
Nice pen pals, Jamar Chase, purple ink autograph. Fireworks, Mac Jones, etc., etc. So I appreciate everyone digging deep and making this break happen. Thank you. Keep your eye out for more mixers like this. You know, we'll, we'll, every once in a while we'll do some mixers where we'll give away some nice cards at the end. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.